Hi, I'm Carrie Fetzer, and welcome to This is Dubois High. Our interview today is with Mr. Doug Conrad, our new band director. But first, one event you'll want to take advantage of is the FAFSA Student Aid Night in the Computer Lab at DHS on February 25th at 5.30 p.m. Students, don't forget your FSA ID. Parents, this is important. And now, here's Don Bador with our interview. Hi, I'm Don Bador, and we're going to go see what Mr. Conrad's up to for an interview. So, Mr. Conrad, nice playing you did there, too. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now, how did um, the early part of the season go, being a new band director and everything? Well, the early part of our jazz band season started off very well. We started rehearsing right after marching band ended in the fall, and we practiced once a week after school, leading up to our performances with our holiday tour, to, out to the local elementary schools in our area, as well as our winter concert. Awesome. Now, there's something big coming up I keep hearing about. What is this um, jazz festival? Oh, okay. Well, here in Dubois in February, we are going to have the pleasure of hosting the Pennsylvania Music Educators Association District 3 Jazz Festival. This will be a two-day festival where 54 students from 18 schools will come to our high school and rehearse and perform a concert. There will also be great things like clinics and as well as performance by local band directors. Awesome. Now how do you prepare for something like this? Well a lot goes into it and this being my first year at Dubois I did not know that I was hosting the festival until I was hired and never having been to one before there are lots of odds and ends that I have never encountered yet. So I've had a lot of great mentor teachers who have hosted festivals in the past really help me through the process because when you host a festival, there is a lot more to it than just having some people come in, rehearse, and then right. putting on a concert. There is also things as it's a multi-day festival, arranging hotels, arranging food, arranging security, and organizing and handing out a lot of paperwork, just a lot of things, and even making a concert program. Mm -hmm. But all in all, it's been a very rewarding experience, and it's going to be a really great experience for music making in our region. Awesome. Now, we have some of our own um, students going to this festival, don't we? Who are the, them? Oh, yeah. Well, we have three <laughs> students here from Dubois High participating in the festival. They are all in the same band. They'll be performing in the blue band. And in that band, we have Jacob Sutter, who plays piano. Rebecca Mahalik on the electric bass, as well as Don Badorf on the tenor saxophone. <laughs> now, could you tell us more about this concert in case someone would like to go see the performance? Well, at the end of the festival, we will be hosting a concert here on Friday, February 19th. The concert will be at 7 o'clock in the Dubois High Auditorium, and tickets will be $5. Awesome. Thank you so much for talking to us, Thank Mr. You. Conrad. Back to you. Thanks, Don. Another great thing coming up is the 10th annual Super Bowl. Come to the DAHS cafeteria on March 2nd from 6 to 8 for all-you-can-eat soup and a handcrafted bowl for only $10. Monster Bowls are $15. This benefits the art programs here at the high school. I'm Carrie Fetzer. See you next time.